is this a bubble in the housing market? Is it gonna pop in 2022? Everyone's asking that question right now that is either looking to buy or sell real estate. Nobody wants to be the one that overpaid and missed, missed the boat. My name is Jake Wire with eXp Realty, and I've been a real estate agent for a decade plus. Um, I've been through the recession in 2008, and I have a lot of clients that are waiting out to see what the market does. And I'm here to tell you that this is not 2008 recession. This is a different situation. We don't have the adjustable rates. We don't have all that stuff. So people that are waiting, thinking that there's going to be this huge glut of foreclosures hitting market, they're going to be buying houses pennies on the dollar, um, and they don't want to miss out. I'm telling you that I do not believe that it's going to happen. And I'm going to tell you exactly why. Right now we are dealing with an unprecedented housing shortage. Um, we have huge demand right now. We have a very uneven market, seller's market, absolutely 100% a seller's market. Now we did see a little bit, you've probably seen online, that you're seeing a little bit more inventory, seeing a little few more houses on Zillow. You have a few more options out there. Um, and we did see a nationwide, we did see a 1% increase in housing inventory. Um, however, we're still short from year to date, short on housing inventory. So compared to 2020 last year, we are looking like a lower inventory than we were at that point year to date. Now, that being said, I think it's gonna be a long time before we get caught up in that housing inventory. We had a lot of builders that decided to either slow down or completely shut down production on new construction, um, just waiting out to see what happened with those material shortages. So we are gonna see this probably at least for a year and a half to two years of a housing shortage before we get caught up. Um, that being said, I think that this is a time that you can get into a less of a bidding war, I guess is probably the best way to put it. Instead of 10, 20 offers and having to waive inspections and all the other things you're having to do to get an inspection and paying $30,000 over asking price, what I'm seeing and what my clients are seeing is that, yeah, the good properties are still getting multiple offers. They are getting what they're asking for, um, even a little bit above, but it's starting to level out a little bit. Um, so do I think that's going to keep going that way? I think maybe through the holidays, it'll keep being that direction. Uh, historically speaking, the holidays are a slow time. People choose not to list during the holidays, um, kids in school, uh, Christmas, all of that stuff. A lot of people just kind of wait through January into February before they're willing to probably make a move on listing the house and things like that. So I do think that we'll see a little bit more inventory hitting market come springtime in 2022. We're still in a huge housing inventory crunch. Um, rates are still great right now. Um, so that is actually helping kind of prop the market up too. I think when rates start creeping up, we might see the balancing of the market a little bit more into a more healthy buyer seller market. Uh, right now, you know, I just would not hold my breath for that huge glut of foreclosures. If you need to make a move, if you're moving to a different area, if you would like to take advantage of these historical interest rates, I would implore that you do. Um, I do not believe those rates are going to be bought down forever. Um, at some point, the feds are going to have to bring those rates up. Um, and I think at that point, we will see a little bit of a shift in the market. But as far as the uh, housing pricing is concerned, I think we're going to continue to see basically what we see right now as far as the uh, prices of a home. I don't think we're going to see a dip. Um, but if you are trying to get into a house and you've been beat out time and time again, um, this holiday season might be a chance for you guys to get out there, take a look at some inventory with a little bit less competition. Uh, that would be my suggestion to you. So if you have any questions about any of this, any questions about the market, my opinions on it, uh, this is Jake Wire, EXP Realty. Love to be able to talk to you. Talk to you soon.